When it comes to podcasting, one of the most important pieces of equipment that you need is a microphone. With all the options out there, it can be difficult to find a microphone that one, fits your budget, and offers the best quality possible. So in this video today, I will be discussing some of the best microphone options out there that are affordable and have the best quality possible. Like I mentioned before, having a good microphone for your podcast is super important. And today I'm gonna to help you find a microphone that fits all your criteria. Now first to start off, there are two different types of microphones. You can get a USB microphone or an XLR microphone. XLR microphones are connected to a mixing board or an audio interface, which allows for you to have more control over the sound of your mic. And typically these kind of microphones are considered a better option for podcasting because they offer more control and flexibility. USB microphones, on the other hand, are a more affordable option for podcasting. They are easy to use and they require no additional equipment. This makes them very popular. They're also very portable, which makes them ideal for recording on the go. So now that we've talked about the two different types of microphones, let's go into the best options for each. So first let's look at some options for USB microphones. First up we have the Blue Yeti, which comes in at $129. The Blue Yeti is one of the most popular USB microphone options on the market as it's great for beginners and experienced professional podcasters. It features four different recording patterns and has a built-in headphone jack so that you can monitor your sound. Next up we have the AT2020 USB-X microphone, which comes in at $149. This microphone has very good sound quality and is perfect for anyone looking for a step up from the Blue Yeti. Finally, another budget option for USB microphones is the MV5. This microphone costs $99. The MV5 is a great affordable option that offers studio quality sound in a compact and durable design. Any of these three USB microphones that I just mentioned will be a great option to purchase for your podcast. Next up, we have the XLR microphones. As I mentioned, these microphones are a little bit more expensive, but with that price tag comes better sound quality. So first up, we have the Rode NT1A. This microphone comes in at $199. This microphone is a great budget option for XLR microphones. It offers great sound quality and is perfect for beginners and experienced podcasters. Next up, we have the SM7B microphone. This microphone is a little bit more expensive, coming in at $399. This microphone is a great mid-range option that has great sound quality and is perfect for anyone looking for a step up from the Rode NT1A. Finally, the last mic in this list for XLR microphones is the Newman TLM 102. This microphone comes in at $729. With that price tag though, you get the best quality and one of the best sounding microphones that you can get on the market today. This microphone is perfect for anyone looking for the best possible sound quality for their podcast. Now, if you get an XLR microphone, you're going to need an audio interface. A great overall option for any XLR mic is the Focusrite Scarlett audio interface. This audio interface is affordable, but also high quality. It features two microphone inputs, which allows you to record from two different microphones simultaneously. It also has two dedicated headphone outputs with separate volume controls for monitoring, as well as two balanced line outputs, making it ideal for both recording and monitoring applications. It offers excellent sound quality and is extremely easy to use. So I hope this video helps you choose the right microphone for your podcast. All the items I mentioned in this video are great quality and will be a great addition to your podcast setup. In the description below, I have links to everything I mentioned in this video so you can easily find each item. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube video. If you haven't already, please go ahead and subscribe to our YouTube channel and turn on post notifications so you are notified when we post. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. If you want to watch more content, we have two awesome videos right here. Thank you so much.